NFL's two all-league running backs, San Diego's Keith Lincoln on the left and Buffalo's Cookie Gilchrist, wish each other luck. Then the Chargers are off and running. Tobin Road masterfully executes a draw play to Lincoln. Don Norton throws a crushing block downfield, and Keith rips up the middle for 40 yards. The Buffalo fans are stunned into silence as Road hits tight end Dave Kusurik on a Y up. It's touchdown. And with the game barely three minutes old, the Chargers lead 7-0. The Bills try to bounce back, but Big Ernie Ladd smothers Gilchrist for no gain, and Buffalo is forced to punt. The San Diegans are on the move again. Halfback Paul Lowe bolts off tackle for 20 yards. And here's where things begin to turn for the worse. Lowe is injured on the tackle. But here's the big play, the tackle heard round the world. Keith Lincoln, attempting to grab his swing pass from Rote, is speared by Buffalo's Mike Stratton. A sickening thud, and now the Chargers are minus Lincoln and Albright. With San Diego holding a slim 7-3 lead, Buffalo straps back. Quarterback Jack Kemp eludes several Chargers, finds Gilchrist on a broken play. Bunkum and Whitehead make the stop. Scoring from there, the Bills move to a 10-7 lead. Coming right back, Cookie Gilchrist crashes off tackle, thunders 39 yards before being run out of bounds by Kenny Graham and Ron Carpenter at the 8-yard line. Then the 17-yard field goal pushes the Bills' lead to 13-7 at halftime, and with things looking gloomy for San Diego, the weather even gloomier, Big Jack McKinnon brightens things up by blasting through and over five Bills on the draw play. Into the fourth quarter, the Bills hold a 13-7 advantage. Kemp flicks a slant pass to Glenn Bass on a 51-yard play. Westmoreland catching Bass from behind on the one-yard line. Buffalo scored on the next play. Buffalo kicks off, and watch little Leslie Speedy Duncan, who thrills millions of fans all day with his record-breaking kickoff return. He shows his blinding speed as he returns the ball 50 yards behind outstanding blocking. Duncan's effort ignites the Chargers, and the San Diegans battle to get back in the game. Hadel passes to Kusurik for 28 yards. Then Hadel passes to fullback Keith Kinderman. Ernie Wright and Walt Sweeney lead Keith for another seven yards to the five. Now it's fourth and five, and on the next play, Hadel tries to find Jerry Robinson on a quick out for the touchdown. But the speedster from Grambling slips on the wet turf, the ball, and the ball game go bouncing away. It's Buffalo 20, San Diego 7. The Bills are the new AFL champions as a partisan Buffalo fan.